How are you guys? I'm making this video for those of you who are interested in buying the Fitbit Charge 5. And unfortunately, I'm going to recommend you not to buy it. And let me explain to you why. Now, I have owned several Fitbit devices and they all present sooner or later the same problem. You see here now, this is the Fitbit Charge 5. Uh, I owned a previous tracker, same thing happened. It's with the battery. But let me explain to you first. I do love this device. I loved it so much. First of all, the battery lasted seven days, which is what I like the most. I don't like charging uh, an, a thing every day. That's a pain, right? And I just love how discreet it was. Also, how easily you could change the bands, the straps, and buy uh, all kinds of colors. Um, also, uh, it measures many things. I always had the SPO2 tracker on and I also liked the fact that it told me my heartbeat because sometimes I wanted to remember, oh, how much have I slept, you know, because sometimes the sleeping thing that doesn't, that never works properly, but you can tell by your heart rate, right, uh, how much have you slept or if you took a nap yesterday and this thing sometimes doesn't even pick it up. So that's another thing I liked. But yeah, what happens is that sooner or later, the battery on these devices always stops working, uh, like really quickly. This one, I bought it in March of last year, and after five months, it happened. I spoke with uh, the customer service of Fitbit, and they replaced it for free. And after seven months, same thing. And now the battery, the warranty has expired. So there's nothing I can do, and they, they don't help me. And I'm not going to pay $150 or even less because now it's only $120. If, after, if I know for sure that after some months it's, it's going to be the same story, right? So yeah, now I've just bought a Galaxy Samsung watch, which I love. It has a lot of features. It's super cool. But there's something I don't like at all. that You have to uh, charge it every day. So I'm still thinking about whether I'm going to keep this or not. But unfortunately, even though I love this, I... I just, I'm not going to replace it because it doesn't work. And trust me, it's not a tantrum that I'm throwing because I'm, I have had bad luck and my device doesn't work. Just do your own research on Google and you will see that it happens to everybody or almost to everybody. These things just don't work. So if you want to buy it, I mean, you can. It's cool. It's super fine. But think that after a few months, you're not going to have any juice. Maybe you're lucky enough and it's still under warranty and they might replace it, but sooner or later you will have to pay every year a hundred and something for this. So I really fell in love with this thing, but it just doesn't work. So if I were you, I wouldn't buy it. Thanks so much for watching this video. Goodbye.